This is the Han Market, also known as Cho Han, in Da Nang City, Vietnam. Han Market, located near the banks of the River Han, was first opened in the 1940s by the French, and it's been busy ever since. If you plan to visit Da Nang City, then watch this video to the end. Info in this video will include directions, times, and of course we'll share our own experiences and tips. Please like this video and write a comment. We really do want to hear from you so that we can keep improving our content. Welcome to HipFig. If you're a travel enthusiast, then join our community by subscribing to this channel. This is the Da Nang City Travel Guide Series. This episode is the Han Market in Da Nang for visitors to Vietnam. Why should you visit Han Market in Da Nang City? Great bargains on souvenirs, clothing, and delicious food. Although much smaller than Benton Market in Ho Chi Minh City, this market whacks a wallop with how much stuff that's inside this two-story building. Located in the heart of the bustling city center of Da Nang City, surrounded by sounds and sights of cars and mopeds, pedestrians bustling around, lies the biggest market in Da Nang. Han Market is located along four main streets in the center of Da Nang. Tran Phu Street, Bok Dong Street, Hung Vuong Street, and Tran Hung Dao Street. The official address is 119 Tran Phu Street, Hao Chai District, Da Nang. Here you can find stall after stall selling an array of local produce, handicrafts, t-shirts, and accessories. Whether you want to shop or just look, it's so interesting to see the variety of fresh local produce and freshly caught seafood. The Han Market is open daily from 5 a.m. to 7 p.m. We arrived around 8 a.m. on a weekday, so it wasn't as busy as it gets later in the day. We took a grab taxi and they dropped us off in the main entrance of Bok Dong Street. Please view our public transport travel guide for Ho Chi Minh City. The section on grab is the same. There will be a travel guide for public transport in Da Nang soon. Aligned outside the building, there are many fruit stalls and flower stalls set in front of the market where you can purchase tropical fruits such as bananas, mangoes, durian, and jackfruit. We entered the market on the first floor, which is my personal favorite. Han Market's first level is where stalls for food are located. You'll find numerous stalls with fresh vegetables, seafood, and butchered meat. By the way, in the morning, the selection is best if you want to purchase. On the second level is where you can purchase home appliances, souvenirs, cosmetics, fabrics. The stalls here are tightly packed one after another full of hats, purses, faux designer items, and clothes. There are also tailors here that make quality and affordable custom made suits and dresses. If you choose this, please calculate a few extra days from when they say that it will be complete so that you don't have to leave Da Nang without your purchase. You'll find these tailors on the upper floor in a section and you'll find women sitting at the sewing machines. On the opposite side, there will also be men repairing and making customized shoes. So check them out if you're interested. If you want to purchase anything um, in the market except food, please make sure to bargain. If prices aren't marked, assume you're being charged double the price locals will pay. And watch to see what other locals or tourists are being charged. The vendors here do want to uh, sell you something, but only if they're going to make some sort of profit. Uh, do bargain the cost down, but if it doesn't match what you have in your mind, then just walk away. If the mar uh, merchant does yell out a price to you and it's agreeable, then go back and buy it. And if you're going to buy three or more items from the same vendor, ask for a discount. Uh, please bargain respectfully. Remember, when we travel, we are all ambassadors of our own respective countries. After looking around and shopping on the second floor, we went down to the first floor for a bite to eat and some more shopping. On the first floor, I purchased a pre-packaged chili paste and co Vietnamese coffee for gifts. If you're buying Vietnamese coffee, buy the Trung Nguyen brand. A premium and very expensive coffee here is uh, Cafe Chon, also known as Weasel Poop Coffee. You can see pictures of weasel on packages, but in most cases it is not pure weasel poop coffee, so be aware. Now to my favorite part of the market. Han Market's indoor food court stalls offers a plethora of Vietnamese dishes. Vietnamese turmeric noodles, 
Kom Tam, aka Broken Rice. Uh, Bansio Crispy Pancake. Oh, my mouth is watering just thinking about it. They also have Goi Kwan, aka the Vietnamese Spring Noodles. And just below the staircase, you'll find rice noodles with marinated beef and pork and uh, buns steamed in banana leaf. OMG. There are so many delicious and authentic Vietnamese uh, dishes to choose from, and they're all at reasonable prices. Most of the food stalls have small stools nearby, but uh, they may not have room so you can stand up and eat. Or you can have it wrapped up to go and eat it by the nearby uh, river promenade. As always, make sure to use your travel common sense when eating street food. And look for longer lines. That means the food will be fresh and good. Many of the vendors spoke English and they definitely talk money using a calculator. Plan on spending at least two or more hours depending on your interest, especially in the food section, exploring, eating, and asking and talking with the vendors. Just don't touch anything before you purchase it. Combine your visit to the Han Market with the nearby Da Nang Cathedral and the Bok Dong Promenade overlooking the Han River and Dragon Bridge. Happy travels! Go to hipfig.com for more information or Go to our HipFig Travel Channel on YouTube and be sure to subscribe for regular updates.